Hello, this is Amit from Digital Inspiration and in today's episode, I'll share a very simple method that will help you save tweets forever in a Google spreadsheet. Now, there can be several reasons why you may want to save tweets. For instance, there could be an interesting hashtag that's trending on Twitter and you want to capture every single tweet that mentions that hashtag. Or you could be a brand manager of some company and you want to capture every single conversation happening on Twitter around your brand. The first thing you need to do is open the Twitter archiver sheet. You can find a link in the show notes and change the name of the sheet to include your search term. So for instance, if I'm trying to track tweets around the hashtag Indian English, I'll just put hashtag Indian English as the sheet name. Now the sheet name can have more search operators as well. So for instance, I can say hashtag Indian English filter links. And in that case, in that case, it will only show tweets that have links. I could use Boolean operators like or and and so on. Now for this example, I'll just keep things simple and use one hashtag as the sheet name. So once you have entered the sheet name, go to tools and choose script editor. Now don't worry, you don't have to write a single line of code. All you have to do is enter your Twitter secret keys here. You'll have to go to the Twitter developers website to get your Twitter keys. So go to dev.twitter.com, sign in with your regular Twitter account and in the upper right corner, click your profile photo and choose my applications. So here click the create new app button and uh, you will be transported to the create an application page. Just put in any data here uh, because this is your internal app, the world won't be using it. So you can just put in any name, any description, just make sure that that name is unique and it doesn't have words like Twitter, etc. because Twitter won't allow it. So for this example, I'll just put uh, archiver as the name and just put in any description. Uh, you can put in your website name in the website field. Now the callback URL field is important. This has to be spreadsheet.google.com slash macros. You can again copy paste this from the show notes. So that's pretty much it. Just agree to the terms and conditions and choose the create your Twitter application button. Now, while you're on the application details page, just choose API keys. And there you should see your consumer key and consumer secret that you need to paste in the Google script. So just copy this data and paste it into your Google script. So we are pretty much done. Now let's close the other two tabs because we don't need them anymore. Now go back to the Google script and under the run menu choose initialize. The first time we run this script, we need to authorize because the script has to read Twitter, it has to write to our Google spreadsheet. So we need to give it certain permissions. So just click accept at the authorization prompt. Next, the Twitter uh, authorization dialog will show up. Now this is requesting only read only access. So it will never be able to publish anything to your Twitter account. So just click authorize here and within a minute or two, Tweets matching your search term should start appearing in your Google Sheet. And so the app seems to work. Now the good part about this Twitter Archiver app is that it saves a lot of other data other than the tweet. So it saves how many followers a person has and how many people he follows and how many retweets or favorites that particular tweet got. So all these things you can use to figure out which are the most influential tweets, which are spam. And uh, you can also click the username of a person to see the tweet on the Twitter website. And because we have this data in a spreadsheet, we can always export it as a PDF file or even publish it as an HTML web page. One more thing, uh, when you install this Twitter Archiver app, it's always running in the background, reading Twitter, and if it finds any new matching tweets, it adds them to the spreadsheet automatically. Now, if you want to stop the tracker permanently, all you have to do is open the script again from Tools Script Editor and choose uh, Stop under the Run menu, and it will stop adding any more tweets to your spreadsheet. I hope you'll find this app useful. Thanks.